Now, a small story before we're going to start. Hi, welcome. This is, of course, Australia. Um, around eight years ago, I arrived there. I knew only one person, this guy Ron. I had a work permit and I had a suitcase. I didn't know anyone. Blank like this photo. I uh, asked Ron, I told him, Ron, look, I have experience in marketing, in PR, in uh, TV, radio. I want to do something similar in Australia. I want to do something significant. And he said, sorry, I don't know anyone. I can't help you. So I found a job in a jewelry store at the local uh, shopping center. I met this guy one day, Daniel, who asked me, so what brought you to Australia? What would you like to achieve? How can I help you? And I said, look, I have an experience in radio, in TV, in PR. I wanted something significant. He said, okay, I know the local radio station. Would you like to maybe work for them? I'm like, yes. So I met the manager. He told me, okay, you have a lot of experience. I love your energies. Your English suck, but I'll give you Tuesday between two to four. Okay. I had my show. Then I met this guy, Eddie, which is one of my best friends until today. Uh, and he also asked me the same thing. What brought you to Australia? How can I help you? And I said, look, I have experience in marketing, PR, TV. I want to do something significant. So he connected me to this really, really cool initiative back then. We went out in different um, clubs and bars and we videoed single people. And then we uploaded the movies online. It was really, really big. I think it was 2005, maybe before YouTube. So I guess uh, this was my first startup. I was uh, the host of Single in the City. We, it was like a dating site where you have video um, cards of people on the website. And this uh, manager, uh, Stephen, also uh, taught me the word entrepreneur. And he said, so what brought you to Australia? How can I help you? And I told him the same story. And he said, I know a daily drama. Would you like to be, be there? I'm like, yeah. So I was uh, participating in two episodes of Home and Away, the 18th, uh, 18th uh, series. And then, you know, weeks went by and I met this really big business person who gave me the chance and sent me some interviews in different places. And then I got this job. 20th floor of the sixth biggest corporate back then in Australia. Uh, they own shopping centers all around Australia. I was in the marketing department. Um, campaign assistance. I was in charge of uh, back to school and Christmas campaign back then. I felt amazing. I felt significant. I said, this is where I wanted to be. And this is all, all thanks to the people I met, which as I told you, are still a really good friend of mine. And eventually the funny thing was that this corporate owned the shopping center, first started working as a, a selling juries. So this is my story. This is one of my stories uh, about basically how from scratch I, I managed to build relationships. And since then, I think it's been almost seven, eight years, I sharpened my skills until today, which basically I teach how to do it.